Now while at Costco, I usually pick up a pizza pie for a pizza hack I like to use with their pizzas. This particular day, however, I ended up eating all the toppings. So first I'll show you the hack that I usually use, and it doesn't have to be a Costco pizza. I've used many different pizzas, but only ones that are topping heavy. Now as you see here, I'm sizing up my cookie cutter. This is about a two and a half inch cookie cutter. You want to place it as close to the edge as possible and then smash down on it cutting through all the layers like this. And as you see here, you have a perfect circle of your cheese, sauce, and pepperoni all in one and ready to go. With this size cookie cutter, you should get three per piece. Now make sure they don't do what they did to me and cut it in twos like this. Then I tear sheets of wax paper and lay them down, folding it over on the next one and stacking them like this. Now once I finish all of them, I'll place them in a Ziploc baggie and then freeze them until I'm ready to use them. Now for my glucose readings after eating all the toppings off that 16 inch pie. It's 10 minutes after eating the pie and as you see here it's at 88. Five minutes later it dropped the point to 87. Then it remained the next five minutes at 87. Then went back up to 88. Five minutes later increased another point to 89. Then remained there for an additional three cycles of 15 minutes. Then increased by one point to 90 for an additional 10 minutes. Then increased to 91, then 92. By the one hour mark, it had increased five points to 93. Then it increased to 94. And then the following 10 minutes, it increased to 95 dropped back down to 94 for the next 10 minutes then it went back up to 95 it increased 1 to 96 then dropped back down to 95 then 94 93 and finally landed at a 92. well for my body that was a pretty good glucose response I really don't have to worry about being kicked out of ketosis. This is not something I normally do, but if I do happen to do it again, at least I know I'm safe in ketosis. If you like this video, go ahead and check out these videos. Guys, thanks for watching, and as always, I'll see you in the next video.